Hello everyone and welcome back to our playthrough of the DMX2 Red with the Gold X. Finally said it right. Also, uh, the DMX version 1 because I wanted to see what would happen if we actually combined them. I know it's supposed to be that you just unlock Beelzebub on X, but just for the small chance that something different might happen, I'm gonna go for it. But look what they evolved into. We were supposed to get War Greymon X Black, um, but instead we got Mammon X. Mammon. Now, why did this happen? I took perfect care of them. I looked into it, and I found that it's actually because while I did take perfect care of them, and that was a requirement to get War Greymon X Black, I didn't have them high enough level. Oh. It's a pretty good face, though. I like- hold on, can I just get another look at that? There was so much going on with that. Hold on, sorry. Uh, cheers. Uh, congratulations. Can I see that again, though? Because that was pretty cool. Okay. Elephant snot. Big, big eyeball. Big, all-seeing third eye. Cool! So they just shoot ele elephant snot and space sparkles. I mean, what more does a mammoth need? Uh, it's probably why they went extinct, though. It's probably not very actually effective. So the idea from this point on is that I'm supposed to take perfect care of them, and I'm supposed to get their level up pretty dang high. Uh, I think I'm allowed one care mistake, and then I got to get them to level seven or eight. And as always, that was my failing whenever it comes to me not getting mons in the DMXs that I wanted, but it's it's still good. Or we could go for another line. We could try to get Ophenimon fall down mode, but that is requiring very specific things. You have to have two care mistakes, you have to have level eight, and you also have to have defeated five plus stage six Digimon, meaning the stage above them. They're an ultimate. I have to defeat five Megas. I don't know about that, that sounds kind of hard. Whatever they turn into though, I think it'll be pretty cool. The thing is though, if they turn into, this is Mammon X, right? If, if we get them to evolve into Skull Mammon X, that's great. It'd be good to, for once, have an evolution line that just kind of makes sense in a flow chart, you know? But at the same time, from that point, we don't have what's required to have them evolve beyond that point. If we get Skull Mammon X, this runs over, basically. Because the only thing that they can evolve into from Skull Mammon X, at least according to Humulus's guide, which again, doesn't have to be correct, it might not be corrected as a fan put together resource kind of thing, uh, but there's nothing they can evolve into, unless we unlock this special area and clear it. There are 45 stages in this game, and there's another area that you get by connecting, you know, both colors together. That's kind of what I'm low-key hoping will happen. Is Oh yeah, by the way, it's Rhinomon X. First they were Gabumon X. Well, for, okay, sorry. They were Putamon when you last saw them. Then they became Tokamon X, then they became Gabumon X, then they became Rhinomon X. My low-key hope is that connecting these two will also, maybe, if I'm lucky, and if the Bandai gods are benevolent and doesn't, they don't want me to buy like every single device, then maybe connecting them will unlock that special area, you know? Oh. Well, this isn't really fair because Rhinomon X is only a champion, whereas Mammon is kind of a, you know, kind of a whole ultimate situation. All right. But maybe if connecting is all it takes, right? Come on, please. Give me that special area. Please, let me have, let me have this. I really want to evolve Skull Mammon X. Ooh, snot and horns. This is like what it's like if you just go out onto the Serengeti. This is just what you're gonna see. It's probably why uh, I don't think a lot of people live on the Serengeti. Just horns and elephants, not right? Do they have elephants in the Serengeti? Oh, they don't anymore. Mammon X, I'm so sorry. Oh, you got sick, man. Okay, so nothing really happened. Uh, I'm assuming that if I hadn't already unlocked Beelzebub on X, something would have unlocked. You know? Here, hold on. Just, just don't, don't lose hope. Don't lose hope. I gotta. I gotta hold out hope. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll be in the lineup. No? M maybe, maybe I have to defeat the other areas? Uh, I can't just rely on that possibility. I think we're gonna have to just take Mammon X and try to get through all the rest of the areas because the rest of them are, are Megas, right? If, if I can just get them to defeat that many Megas. Five plus Megas, then we get Ophanimon Fall Down Mode X. Uh, going from an elephant to that would be kind of weird, but not, you know, it wouldn't like ruin me. Dark Nightmon X. They're a Mega, right? Come on. It's it's stage 36. It's got to be nothing but Megas from here on out, right? Although Ogremon X is not a Mega. I don't even think they're an ultimate. Okay, I'm looking at the charts and it does look like Dark Nightmon X is indeed uh, an ultimate. Although, hold on. No, they're, they're Mega. 
No, nope, yeah, yeah, they're mega. I was looking at Wikimon, which uses the Japanese naming conventions, and they said ultimate, and I was like, hmm? but no, it's mega. This is, if we can defeat Dark Knight Mon X, then yeah. And it, maybe we could just do that like five times, you know? I think that could, I think that could do, do pretty well. But not if we're going to put up that kind of performance, you know? It's fine. We can make things work. We can jump back to the Numamon zone, level them up a bit, and then tackle it again. I mean, right now, they're only like, I think they're still only level three. Just their base level. Oh, man, Mon X, you're going to have to pull off something really stylish here, dude. Come on. Oh, we're going to lose this, aren't we? Don't lose. Oh, you did the thing I said not to do. It's okay. It happens. God, I love this handkerchief. If I suffer defeat, I go, oh, oh. All right, that's my homework. I will train them up, get them up to high levels with the Nimbamon zone, and then I will take on Megas at least five times, and then I'm going to aim for Ophanimon fall down Modex because I want them to be able to evolve. What about you? Did you unlock anything? I mean, it was two X's, right? So come on. I mean, you already had special area unlocked, I suppose. So yeah, on the other hand, I don't know, but it, w things will be revealed to me as I go along because that's what it looks like, area sp. Things will be revealed because on my path to training them up to being able to become Ophanimon Fall Down Modex, there's a good chance I'll just clear all the areas. And then if the area special is something that unlocks after all the other areas are done, then it would reveal itself at that point. But I don't think that's how it worked in the DMX version one. I'm pretty sure area special was just unlocked immediately after connecting. So eh, they're good babies. And that's all I want them to do, is just keep being good babies. You know, they, they don't have to become super ultimates, duper megas, to, you know, satisfy those requirements for me, okay? But that's all for today. Thanks everyone for hanging out with me. Thanks patrons for supporting this channel, especially Nobro Shifter and Dog Trainer 89 I'll see you all next time. Have a good one!